Hey everyone, it's me Jens from the Demo Creator channel and I'm going to be your host today. In the current day and age, especially during the pandemic that's going on right now, many people do not have the chance to talk to other people directly or go to school right now. And now imagine the situation you want to get married. Your loved one just proposed to you and now you want to bring the good news over to your mother but you can't see her directly but you want to tell her and you also want to capture the moment when you tell her about the good news. What can you possibly do? Well one good idea would be to create a Skype conversation with your mother and your father for example and then you are going to capture the Skype conversation directly on your PC. And what you could do is you could for example use the implemented Skype call recording option that comes with Skype in itself but this could pose a few problems. Fingers if you already got a slow internet connection or maybe your computer in itself is pretty slow on its feet then Skype is going to strain your PC pretty hard. Meaning if you record a call that's already kind of laggy and you use the implemented um, option to record the Skype call also it's going to be kind of straining for your PC which can make the call and thus the recording in itself pretty laggy and this really doesn't feel like a good experience overall. But there is a solution for this problem. Namely, you could use Wondershare's Demo Creator, the main product of this channel, to record the Skype call externally. And if you are new to Wondershare's Demo Creator, make sure to download it first before progressing with the tutorial. You can find the link to the free trial down there in the description, download it and then we can dive right into the main meat of the video, shall we? Also, if you are new to the channel, make sure to subscribe to the Wondershare Demo Creator channel as well as to click the little notification bell down there. With it, you are going to be notified about further updates of Wondershare Demo Creator as well as new videos coming out here on this channel. So before we can start recording using Wondershare's Demo Creator, make sure to set all the audio options up in Skype in itself. For this, go to Skype, then up here onto the three dots and go to Settings. Once you're in the settings, make sure to go down to the audio and video options and to activate your microphone, so your default microphone that you want to use for your call. You can see that it's activated by the little dots that are going to pop out over time. And also you need to activate your speakers. Speakers are important because they are going to be transferred via your Windows Audio too, which you can record using one chest Demo Creator. Once all of this is set up, you can save your options and now we can go ahead and start the call with our loved one. Now after starting the Skype call with my currently AFK friend over in the next room I'm going to click on new recording here in Wondershare's Demo Creator and once that's done we need to set up some settings in Wondershare's Demo Creator such that we can actually record everything that the other person is saying, everything that we are saying currently as well as the screen because you know we want to film our mother's reaction to us getting married right now. At first you definitely need to set the screen size and for this you can either choose the frame that you want to record in some way. Okay, if you just want to record a small frame, then that's totally fine. Or you can click on full screen to record everything. After that is done, here come the most important options, namely the audio settings. For this, click on the little gear icon to see some further options. Once you're in the settings, just like with Skype, you're going to click on audio and from there on you can start setting up the audio settings. So most importantly, you want to hear what the other person is saying. This is why we activated the speakers before, because they are going to be transferred as computer audio. You want to set this option to capture and then you can record what your mother is saying. Other than that, we also want to record what we are saying, obviously. For this, you are going to change your microphone options from don't capture to the microphone that you want to use during your conversation. Other than that, you want to get a very smooth picture. You want to see everything clearly with nice frames per second. For this, you are going to click on the screen option and then you are going to set up from 30 FPS, for example, to the highest one possible, 120 FPS. This way, everything is going to work out very smooth and then you can edit it nicely with a lot of frames per second after recording. After you're done with the settings, click on capture and then click on the big red recording button here. And now you can start talking to the AFK person that I'm talking to right now. Hello, what are you doing at the moment? Very funny, right? And after you're done with the conversation, click on the big red button yet again. And after that, Wondershare's Demo Creator is going to track you over from its recording interface to its editing interface, where you can edit everything nicely one after another. 
And I'm not going to go into any detail about how you can edit videos because I actually made a bunch of videos on that topic already. So in-depth explanations about how to edit videos in Wondershare's Demo Creator. For that just go down there, click on the Wondershare Demo Creator channel and definitely make sure to subscribe and to take a look at all the videos I created there already. And this basically concludes everything I want to talk about today. And once again, Wondershare's Demo Creator is just wonderful. Because in comparison to just recording the Skype call using the built-in Skype call recording option, you can just record everything with Wondershare's Demo Creator. And after stopping the recording, you can go over into the built-in editing interface to edit everything in one program. So no need to download any other programs that have paywalls in it. All you need is one of Demo Creator to, to do everything all in one program. And that's it. If you enjoyed this video, definitely make sure to subscribe to the Demo Creator channel and I bid you farewell. Please stay safe and I'm going to see you in the next video here on the Demo Creator channel. Ciao.